All right, this is the lung model. Um, when we look at the top, this is the hyoid bone, your thyroid cartilage of your larynx, your cricoid cartilage, and your trachea. Um, you can see your thyroid gland here. And if you look at the top, you could actually see the glottis and the epiglottis. So the glottis is the opening. Um, when we look at the lungs, you need to know the difference between your left side and your right side. Your left lung has two lobes. You have your left superior lobe and your left inferior lobe. Your lobes are divided by fissures. So the fissure that divides the left superior and the left inferior lobe is called the left oblique fissure. Now there is an indentation on the left lobe where the heart is going to sit. This is called the cardiac notch. So you can open this model up and you can also see the oblique fissure. Um, on the right side, you have your right superior lobe, your right middle lobe, and then over here, your right inferior lobe. Now the apex of your lung is the poignant portion, and this is the base that sits on top of the diaphragm. Your right middle and inferior lobes are also divided by fissures. The fissure that divides the right superior lobe from the right inferior lobe is called the right, or sorry, the horizontal fissure because it's more straight across the horizontal fissure. The right middle lobe is divided from the right inferior lobe because you have the right oblique fissure and oblique means it's at an angle. We can open that up and also see the three lobes. Right superior lobe, right middle lobe, right inferior lobe, and then you have your horizontal fissure and your right oblique fissure. This is your diaphragm um, behind your trachea posteriorly would be your esophagus. So this right here would represent the gastroesophageal sphincter that would lead to the stomach. Now the esophagus does penetrate through the diaphragm at the esophageal hiatus, which is an important thing to note. Now we're gonna remove the heart so that we can see the um, trachea. The trachea ends at the last tracheal cartilage called the carina. At the carina, we are going to split into your primary bronchi for the bronchial tree. Now your bronchi, your primary bronchi, are gonna split into three secondary lobar bronchi for each lobe. However, your left side, your secondary bronchi are only gonna split into two because there's only two lobes. And then when those split, this is called your tertiary or segmental bronchi.